Okay, guys, we're back uh, with this uh, uh, face we're doing out from clay to wood. Uh, uh, off camera, I went in and I, uh, I did, a little, uh, did a little bit more work right up here around the brow line, I mean the eye line, and I worked on the ears and the hairline. But what we're going to do now is we're going to start in here, we're going to lay this mustache in, and we're going to uh, go in here and make the eye sockets and, uh, and develop a bridge of the nose, like right in there. But with that, I'm just going to set that down and we're going to get started here. Uh, I'm going to come in right in here. Well, first of all, I got to take a V tool. This is a, about a 5 8 V. I come down that mustache line like that and do it on the other side. And uh, I, I was saying last week, uh, this may be three videos uh, we'll just see how it goes uh, all right we got that in and now what I'm gonna do I'm gonna develop this wing of the nose just a little bit better than what I've got it I'm gonna come in here with my straight edge knife and make me a little triangle cut and develop the wing of that nose like that right there and I'll do it on this side over here now so you and uh, what I'll do next time as uh, off camera I'll do one side of the face and finish up and then we'll when I get back on the next YouTube we'll uh, work on uh, the, the other side now what now that I got that in there I'm going to uh, shave it down just a little bit more uh, I take my V and kind of lay it on the, this chisel side and kind of shave that down and make that mustache stand out just a little bit more like that right there all right I'm gonna turn it around can you see that all right Peyton yep all right <clears throat> I want to thank everybody for watching the videos. Uh, I enjoy doing it, and uh, I've gotten good response from everybody. Uh, I'm going to try to keep them coming at you. Uh, I enjoy doing them. Okay. Now that I got that in, I'm going to take my knife blade and, and, uh, and cut back against that a little bit. And before I forget it, I'm going to put my little thumb guard on. Let me set this up. This is just a little medical adhesive wrap, but I, it kind of protects my thumb. And when you're, uh, when you're pulling the knife towards you like this, towards your thumb, you want that in there. And I, want, I really want to make that mustache kind of pop out there a little bit more. All right, let's see, let's relieve this a little bit here. Cut that. And I'm gonna kind of shave away at this mustache a little bit. Now, that's looking where I need it to be. Now what I wanna do is, I'm gonna uh, put me a center line just right in here. I'm gonna develop the bridge of this nose. I'm gonna come down through here with a gouge on this side and one on this side. So let's see, I'm gonna take, and this is a number nine, a large number nine, come in and got that right there. 
And mm -hmm. I've developed the, the bridge of the nose. I'll come on this side. Can you see that, Peyton? Yep. All right. All right and I'm gonna run my gouge down like that and really make the bridge of that nose stand out. On that side and that side. Now, what I've did, I've, I've developed some little high ridges right in there. So I'm going to take, uh, uh, well, this is where an upsweep knife is, is handy. You can come in and you can kind of shave and kind of scoop those little areas away. And that's what, that's what that curve is in there for. Uh, I've, I've found these to be real useful. Uh, you don't have to use them. You can go in and, 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 and do this also with a straight blade, but it just curves a little bit better. All right, I'm gonna do it on this side here, on the other side. Uh, come in right in here. Yeah, take that little high ridge off. All right. Now, I, I put some little sharp edges right here. I'm gonna uh, kind of round these edges and get those to where they're not as sharp or you don't have that real sharp edge in there. Now, yeah, he's looking, he's coming right along. He looks pretty serious in there. All right, what I want to do now, before I even get into the eyes, I'm going to develop the, the wing of this nose right in here. And uh, let me turn around here and get my number five. This is a number uh, five gouge. Uh, let's see if it's going to fit yet. Yeah. Well, yeah, it'll, it's going to work. I come in here and I, I put it in at an angle like that, and I round that wing of the nose with this gouge, and then I cut back against it. And that gives me a, a wing of the nose right in there. Right in there, it's a really good definite cut. And then I do it on this uh, other side, and I wanna keep looking at it to, I wanna keep them as even as possible. And this is just a little curved stop cut. That's all it is. And then you cut back against it. And then you can round this a little bit more. But that really sets in the wing of the nose right there. Can you see that, Peyton, all right? Yep. All right, now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get in here and I'm going to Put some eye sockets in and I'm going to take a about a quarter inch number nine and I'm going to put it right in here and I'm going to start working it up this way and kind of arching that brow just a little bit more and then I'm going to bring it on out over this way All right, now, there's the view you want to see there. Now, and I'm trying to get this as close as possible. We'll see where this really, this eyebrow is really up high. That's what I'm going for right there. Now, I'm gonna take this little number five and come right in here and make me a little cut right there where the temple area and the forehead kind of meet right in there. Now, let's turn it over here, and we're going to put in this side here. And uh, let's see here. I'll turn it this way. Yeah. And I just start gouging out my... 
eye socket. And I might want to, on this side, I'm going to turn it around and work down this way. And if, on this model, it, it, it's really, it's got some really uh, deep set eyes in there. And that's what I'm, that's what I'm going for right now. And, uh, and you want them really deep in the, the inside corners here. How much time we got there, Pete? They're about five minutes. Five minutes, all right. We'll be able to uh, draw in these eyes and, uh, but I was really trying to get this formed here. Let me turn around and get my number seven. I'm gonna take my number seven and come right in here rather than that five and and put my temple area in. That give me an area there and then I'll do this here. Now, uh, I'm gonna separate these eyebrows here real quick with a number uh, Number quarter inch number nine. I'm gonna come right in here. Is that you see that all right, Peyton? Yep. All right. And work down this way. And really, really want to make these eyebrows really stand out. And what I'll do on off camera is I'll, I'll go in and do one side and then we'll do the other on the next uh, video. And I'll kind of get him cleaned up like I usually do. All right, now I'm gonna take this and remove that wood there. And this is where our upsweep is good too. All right, now I do need to establish more of a sideburn here. in here I got a twisted piece of grain in there and I'm ha having trouble with that and you run into that you just don't know what when you get your wood you don't know what's how it is all right I made that stand out a little bit more now I want to what I want to do now before I even draw the eyes in I'm gonna go in and and develop this area, the below the mustache. And turn it around and come this way. Uh, how much time we got, Peyton? About a minute. About a minute. Okay, uh, I'm gonna draw in where the eyes are gonna be. Right here and right here, and I come across right there. But I just kind of want to give you a, a general idea where the eyes will be, where, where the eyes are going to lay. Can you see that on the camera, Peyton? Yep. Okay. Uh, what I'm going to do uh, off camera is I'll finish up this side. I'll do some hair, and I'll, uh, and then we'll finish up the chin and and uh, work on these eyes a little bit more. Now it won't be. I, I'm going. I'm not going to make it exactly like this one here. You just have this as a go by. But uh, until the next uh, video, everybody stay safe and. 
Happy carving, and we'll see you next time. Bye.